purpose for this session is to discuss the QC lead time field that's been added to the component um, setup component entry screen. Prior to uh, Vicinity 2.9, the only lead time that was being used by Vicinity's MRP was derived from um, either Microsoft Dynamics or within Vicinity, but there was only one lead time field. Uh, recently, we've had some requests from clients to be able to provide two lead times, one that is really vendor specific. How long does it take the product to get from the vendor to um, the production facility, and then a second lead time uh, to be added to the first uh, that represents quality controls lead time. So once the raw material gets here, how long do we normally expect before that raw material can actually be used in production? So in this case, um, on the component entry screen, I've brought up one of my raw materials, and I have a QC lead time uh, field that uh, is new to 2.9 and I can add five days to that. Uh, whatever number I, I want, I can put that number in and that is the number of days in which the MRP uh, regeneration will add to the traditional lead time that uh, normally is stored in Dynamics. Uh, so if I had a seven day lead time from the supplier and a five day lead time for quality, I would have a 12 day lead time that MRP is using to determine when uh, product needs to be here and therefore when the purchase order or for that matter a batch ticket needs to be generated uh, to get that inventory here on time.